Hello, hello. I'm Scott. I'm. I'm. This is Scott Rooney, and I, this is second grade at Kennedy School. And here's here's Miss here's Mrs. Chase, our teacher. And I would like to introduce to you what we've been doing on com, on computers so far. First, I'll I'll show you. Here's what we've been doing. This is David, and this is a, a, math, a math program that we've been doing where we just practice our math facts. And it's, and there's, and it's, and it's different from all the, most of the other computers because it's mostly just practicing and there's no, no, no really, actually no, no kind of game part to it like most of the other ones. But, and over here, we have Clayton working on Word Spinner, where it'll have two letters at the end, and you press the arrow keys up and down to move through the al alphabet, and every time you get a word that's right, it gives you 10 points, and every time you get one that's wrong, it subtracts 10 points. I, th uh, I think it gives you 20. And... There's a there's a little as you can see there's a little box or whatever you call it and every time you get it full then it'll it'll have numbers and and you pretend like you're spinning for a prize and you, you press the space bar and when you and when you let go of the space bar whatever one it's on then I'll show show what was supposed to be under that and you can pretend like you you won that prize. This is. Here's Carla, and here's Nick, and they've been working on this story program where you you write a story and then it has different characters and it moves them around, as you can see here. They're running a story right now, and what you do is you have, get, have two people get together and then you have to choose from these words to make a sentence. And then whatever you put in this, whatever action you put in the sentence, it'll put the thing that's doing the action, it'll make it do what you, what you wrote. Like if you wrote the, like, the girl will go to the store, then it'll make a picture of a store and a girl, and then they'll run to the store. Anything like that. On this computer, we've been doing, uh, what you do is first you read a story, and then it'll ask you. It'll it'll put certain events, and then you, and then it'll ask you what happened next, and you press what happened next, and then after that you do this game right here that they're doing, where it'll have some candles in a certain way, and you put the steps in the right order, so that they'll end up like these, so that these will end up like these. Okay, move over to here. This is one that we didn't start with. We have just started about a few days ago, right in the, And the first few games, it'll ask, it'll ask, it's learning about what different parts of sentences is. And like the where part, the what part, the who part. And they're doing one where it'll have a story, and then there's a blank, and you fill in the blanks. But one one of the most neatest, one of the most neat things we've done here is lots is when you do lots of the other games, then over here, then you can print it out with our printer over here, and it'll print you a certificate with your name and the date, and it'll t tell like how much you won and what you did in the game, how and how well you did. Okay, what Scott Roney and I have tried to do is give you an overview of what we do in the primary grades at Kennedy in computers. We've used them through math and reading 
and writing of stories, which is an introduction to word processing, and then putting other stories together in creative writing plus comprehension of reading skills in this uh, computer here. The kids seem to really enjoy doing this, plus it gives them another um, introduction to computers and maybe makes them not feel quite so afraid of them as we get older. We hope that this gives you a good overview of what we've done at Kennedy through the primary grades in computers and then Scott Reynolds will show you what we've done in the intermediate grades. Hello, I'm Jennifer Boyd here in fifth grade Kennedy School and this is our teacher Mr. Reynolds. One of the things we do at Kennedy is get involved with computers at an early age and we have several hundred different types of programs at Kennedy but mainly they're broken into about six or seven different areas. For instance, today the kids wanted to show you one that involved word processing. Um, we have a simulation. We have a programming disk. We have a drill and practice. And uh, we'll just have to see what else the kids want to show you today. One of the things we also like to do is work with computers. So I'm going to introduce some of the kids and what some of their programs are about. And I'll let them tell you a little bit on what each program is about. First of all, we have Vinny Narciso, Jeremy Parks, Kevin Haight, Brian Pipes, and Melody Ritiker on, the, on a program disc entitled Drill and Practice. They are working on a certain program that is titled Word Attack. Vinny, do you have any words to tell on how Word Attack and what the purpose is behind it? Well, what, what is happening here is that you have to, the definition down here, you have to kill, you have to shoot this up here and you get a certain amount of points. We're playing word attack right here. And it gives you a certain amount of time. And this is how many times you get to do it until it gets harder. Your score and your value. And the high is 7,200. Thank you, Vanny. Our next group over here is entitled Graphics, and they are using the Koala Pad Painter. This is Mandy Hand and Joshua Kuntz working on a program entitled Koala Painter. It is, has to do with graphics. Mandy, can you tell what the purpose is and the opportunity of this? Okay, okay. Um, what she has to do, there's all kinds of things that you and you can draw something on it and then like frame it and draw, fill it in. And you can make all kinds of pictures with it. This is Jody Lynn with her group, Michael Boyd, Kalani Alvarez, and Jeremiah Schmitz. They're working on a program disc entitled Computer Programming. The certain program they are doing on this disc is Logo. It involves many different things, so let me have Jody tell you about it. Jody? Logo is a simple program where you draw graphics using simple commands. Some of the commands are right or left, forward or backwards. You can also change the pin color by putting PC and then whatever color you want. And you can draw very simple things or harder things. This is Billy Heineke with his group working on a program entitled Cells. This is Billy Heineke, Jamie Stone, Jared Haley, and Carrie Rohr. This also <clears throat> involves many different things, so I'm going to let Billy and his group tell you about it. Billy? This is a simple program um, that has descriptions of cells and what they do, and there are questions you have to answer on it. What you've seen today is some of the different ways that the fifth grade uses computers here at Kennedy School. Other things we'll be doing in the future, we hope, possibly using some of our programs, traveling to science fairs, maybe starting a computer club, using it in our classroom to type spelling sentences and other things like this. Jennifer, why don't you wrap it up? Thank you very much for visiting Kennedy School, fifth grade, for American Education Week.